In this question, we have to find the value of EX. EX is the expected value of this distribution, and to calculate it, we'll use this formula from section 4.7 of the formula booklet. This formula shows us that to find the expected value, we have to multiply each X value by the corresponding probability, and then add up these products. So in our solution, we'll add 1 times P, plus 2 times P, plus 3 times P, plus 4 times 1 half P. This gives us that EX is equal to P, plus 2P, plus 3P, plus 4 times 1 half P. Continuing, we get that EX is equal to 8P, and in the previous question part, we got that P is 2 over 7, so when we substitute, we get 8 times 2 over 7, giving us 16 over 7 for EX. Let's see a tip to make your work easier on similar questions. To find the expected value here, we use the formula that is given in section 4.7 of the booklet. I found in my teaching that this formula might be a bit confusing because of the sigma sign, so the big E looking symbol, that is included here. To make this formula more clear, let's translate it from mathematical language into the English language. One way to do this is to say that this formula shows you to multiply each x value by its corresponding probability, and then add these products to get the expected value for the distribution.